I'm Jamal Simmons. Welcome to What America's Thinking for September 30th. Today, Congress begins its fall recess. Members aren't scheduled to return to Capitol Hill until October 15th. But some people are wondering if Speaker Pelosi should have canceled recess because of the impeachment inquiry against Donald Trump Congress launched just a week ago. Well, despite the recess, the House is still working. The Intel Committee promises to keep going with the investigation of the whistleblower complaint. Adam Schiff, the committee chairman, the guy who's running this whole thing for Pelosi and the Democrats, you know, Adam Schiff says his panel will continue working through the two-week congressional timeout. But like I said a minute ago, for some, that's still just not enough. Progressive groups and Democrats are calling on House leadership to cancel the recess to allow Congress to move forward with the impeachment inquiry. Full steam ahead. It's not just the outside groups, though. Some Democratic members of Congress, people like Ro Khanna, Ilhan Omar, and 2020 hopeful former Congressman Beto O'Rourke, they want more work and less recess, too. But according to The Hill, our paper right here, House Majority Leader Steny Hoyer said there are no plans to cancel recess as it provides a chance for members to communicate with their constituents about the impeachment inquiry. But what do you think? We asked, should the U.S. House cancel recess and begin impeachment proceedings as soon as possible? Our Hill Harris X Daily Poll found that a majority of Americans want congressional recess to be canceled to begin impeachment proceedings as soon as possible. 54% of people said so. 46% on the other hand do not think recess should be canceled. 77% of Democrats feel the House should cancel recess, while 64% of Republicans and 55% of independents disagree. Let me just say this. I was the chief of staff to a member of Congress for a while, and there is some truth to Steny Hoyer's position. Most members of Congress aren't headed to the beach, though I bet some of them are. Most members go home and do town hall meetings and speeches to local groups. Many of them run into constituents at the grocery store or high school football games. And believe me, they're gonna get an earful. And if you see any members of Congress waiting in line for a flight to Aruba, we'd love for you to drop the dime right here on our YouTube page. Thanks for watching What America's Thinking. As always, you can catch more great content from Hill TV by subscribing to the Hill's YouTube channel. Just click the bell so you know when new videos get posted. And head to thehill.com for all the latest political news. You can also find me at Jamal Simmons on Twitter and at Real Jamal Simmons on Facebook and Instagram. See you next time.